a lot of the thinking that influenced my work is rather recent. There isn't much conversation uh, from the past about how to develop policy better, how to go about it in a different way. The processes we use, the actions, the activities, the attempts over time to get to a better idea. It's more about looking back the policy analysis where we look back and critique the old policy. We can name hundreds of ways that NCLB failed because we spent a great deal of time talking about how it failed. What we've not spent more time on is thinking about what its replacement ought to look like and getting to that point. And we haven't had the processes to get to that point. So I think we're in a time where um, democratic ideals are feeling like ideals rather than the practical way we work. And there is a yearning uh, for more democracy, and I think a learning for more social learning and engagement, that connection with each other to be part of this work. So um, those ideas of deliberative democracy, I think, are really spreading in interesting ways all around the world and in different policy arenas. And education policy is just sitting ripe for that kind of both intellectual conversation about it as well as the practical application of it.